three and i am average will and welcome back to the channel thank you for coming back if you are new here well get comfortable put on some comfy pants get yourself a snack get a blanket get comfortable and and hang out for a little bit for this video <laughs> so uh we are doing another mystery monday monday mystery i don't know how the hell i'm going to title these things you guys let me know in the comments below what should we should be titling these these videos every monday that i'm dropping uh it's where i open up mystery boxes from a variety of different companies uh instagrammers folks in the community all that fun jazz i don't know mystery monday monday mystery but anyhow the concept of today's video is going to be a play on the box battle. I did one myself where I took uh, That Spider-Man booth, Box Heroes, and Comic Vantage and compared those boxes all about a, a $30 to $40 value. Put them together, right? And, and, and we compared them. You see other people do them with $100 boxes, even bigger boxes. Um, but today we're going to do it with same price points inside the same company. Today we're going to take two $50 mystery boxes from Rabbit Comics and we're going to compare them. We're going to take their exclusive comics uh mystery box which is fifty dollars which is five of their exclusives and if you've been on their website which i suggest highly down in the comments or the description below you click on their website follow them on instagram and check out the beautiful covers they have but you get five of their exclusives that could be something from ivan tau um javon jordan or illis Luma, illis illuminati words are very hard <laughs> um uh who else you got ivan tau illis illuminati johnny d sardinias Gorkum Demir, beautiful covers uh, for a, a wider range of you know books. You, from you've got We Live, uh, Something to Kill the Children, uh, House of Slaughter, and stuff like that. Monkey Meat, the new stuff, Rising Sun, uh, Radiant Black, uh, Radiant Red is the new cover that they just dropped. So definitely give them a check out, but we're taking their $50 exclusive, like I said, which is five of their exclusives, five of them for $50. Plus you get these kick-ass, kick-ass stickers right here. Love the stickers, love them. I have a stash of them. And then we're taking their $50 comic book mystery box, which is 10 books. You're gonna get seven back issue books and then you're gonna get three of their exclusives. Now with the exclusive box you have a one in 25 chance at a medal i don't think we got one just because per the weight the medals are got a little bit of weight on them um and then with these you have chances at ratios and other stuff like that plus you'll get you know like i said they've got three exclusives so we're going to compare them we're going to see what they what you can get out of each of them i'm not doing prices on books uh we leave that to the others in the community that do that which is great gives you an idea of what stuff is valuing at uh from where but these, especially like with their exclusive box, um, again, beautiful covers. You got the Johnny V. Sardinez uh, palette knife uh, technique, which is beautiful. I have a the, the couple from We Live, uh, the one of Alice and then the one of Hotato. I love those covers. Uh, but yeah, you have a bunch of different ones. And I, I like uh, Javon's Monkey Meat cover. That one's a really nice one. So, and Ivan Tao, man. Ivan Tao, I think, is... Him and Javon are two of the hottest cover artists right now, in my opinion, uh, for indie variants. So yeah, that's just my opinion. That's this. That's this schmuck's opinion. So let's first get into the the exclusive, uh, which is going to be five books for fifty dollars. And again, give their give their website a look at because they have multiple now. They put a bunch of different varieties. Uh, the ding and dents are all sold out as of the last time I checked, which about five minutes before making this video. Uh, their ding and dents are sold out right now, but they have slab mystery boxes. You can get three blue label slabs and put with a potential of getting a signature slab for $100. Uh, free shipping, because you get free shipping at $100. So then you go to $200, you can get three signature series books. You know, that, that's pretty, pretty nice. $200, three yellow label books, and they're exclusives that you, you know, if you, you could get some nice books. And then they have new price point ones. They got a $50 mystery box, which we're gonna open up. They've got a $25 mystery box and a $10 mystery box. So again, if you don't wanna spend a bunch of money, you wanna throw 10, 25 bucks into it, you can, you can get some nice little mystery boxes with a chance of some sweet covers. And then of course their exclusive mystery box, which we're gonna look at now. So let's jump into there. Here's the first book from the $50 exclusive mystery box. 
first cover, what do we get? Oh, Primordial number one. I uh, cannot remember the person that did this. Um, I think this was a, yeah, this is a Nino. Yeah, this is a Nino cover, which I love. If you haven't read Primordial, get on it. It's a great, it's a fun read. It's cool, man. It's trippy. You get the, uh, you get the dog, you get the, the uh, monkeys in space. It's a fun story. And, and the whole conspiracy theory thing. Oh, we got it. We got heathens. I can see the the uh, COA on the back. So this is a, this is an Ivan Tau. Let me let me take the glare off of here so you can see this beautiful cover. Beautiful cover, man. Ivan Tau. This is Ivan Tau. This is the beautiful work that Ivan Tau does. And this is gonna be number 96 of 250. So there's only 250 of those bad boys. And you gotta love them being in Mylar, right? All right, this one was looking at us, but here we go. Radiant Black. I want to say this is Radiant Black 10. Might be Radiant Black 11 or even 9. I know that this is another Ivan Tau beauty. Again, just love, love, love the art from Ivan Tau. And again, link to their website is going to be in the description below. Give them a check out. Again, $50. You're getting these five exclusives. Beautiful covers from artists like Ivan Tau. Again, with conventions coming back, you're going to have a chance to see people like uh, Javon, who I know a bunch of people, which I was bummed because, again, I didn't get to go to C2E2. Um, but I know he was at C2E2, and he's going to be at a bunch of other of the big conventions. So uh, we got the Girl Scouts number one, and this is another – yeah, man, this is this is almost Ivan Tao box, right? We got that first Nino and then three straight Ivan Tao covers. And this one has a COA as well, and this was a 400-print run. This is 118, a 400. And again, you gotta love it. Look at that little, look at the little guy on her shoulder. It's like, what the hell? Sitting on top of a, what is that, a monster thing? I have not read this story yet, so pretty sweet cover. And last one, got some Department of Truth, Beauty, uh, 12, 11? I don't know, I can't remember which one this one was, but it's so cool. The Mr. Freeze, or whatever it is, it looks like Mr. Freeze to me. The whole homage to that was pretty nice. And I cannot see who read this, or who, who read this, who made this one. But yeah, so there's our five covers for $50. The five exclusives, it's pretty nice, right? Pretty nice. Uh, I have to say I like them all. I do have, um, I have the Department of Truth and I have the Nino Primordial number one, but it doesn't hurt to have extras again to get signatures and stuff like that. Nice books to have. Again, planning on doing some conventions this year. Already did one. Uh, went to St. Pete Comic Con, a small little inaugural show for them. Pretty nice. Can't wait, can't wait for, uh, we get into, what is it, May? And then August, Oof, we're gonna have some fun. May you got uh, Megacon, August you have C2E2. I'm looking forward to it. All right, so here's the first one. Now, again, this was uh, 10 books for $50, seven back issues, and then three exclusives with a chance at some ratios and stuff like that as well. So here we go. First book up. Oh, good old Moon Knight. I am. I'll take this all day. This is one of my new favorite series. This is my favorite Marvel series currently. I do love Strange Academy. I love me Thor. Uh, I'm liking the new Venom. But Moon Knight, this is just this has been great for me reading this. I'm trying not to have the glare. That is awesome. I love it. His mission is justice. Wow. Gotta commentate the video, right? Or the, the covers. Oh, look down at this one. So we got some radiant black. This is issue number eight. And this is Kyle Higgins has done so, is doing something special with this. The world that they're creating, the universe that they're creating now, with going into Radiant Red, um, and then also what is it, the Rising Sun or something like that? Rogue Sun, I think it's the other. Yeah, Rogue Sun, uh, building that universe. I'm excited. I'm excited to see how we're all going to do this. So here we go. Next book up. Ooh, Eat the Rich. Nice. This is number three. Is this the B cover? I think this might be the B cover. Uh, with this series, I only got the A cover, and then if there was a Frizen, I would get the Frizen because I love me some Jenny Frizen. But there we go, Eat the Rich, number three. Story was good. Story, I, I liked it, and then the end was just kind of like, oh, okay. 
kind of kind of thing. All right, next one. Oh, nice. Because I do not have any of these. I am happy about this. We got some Animal Castle. Um, I missed out with my shop because I didn't realize this book was coming out. And it was after FOC. And is this number one? No, this is number two. Dang. I'll have to, I'll have to get me a copy of number one. But I've heard great things about it. So I'm happy to have it. Next up. Ooh, Friday. Nice. Is this number one? Yeah, this is number one. This is another book. Uh, I was not paying attention for the FOC and the previews and completely forgot to ask for it and didn't get it. Even though this is, yeah, it's an image book. But yeah, our shop did not get extra. We, we did not get many of these. So I missed out on that. Happy to have it now. Next up. Ooh, Capisi. Nice. And the Dragon Incident. This is from Aftershock. I did not read this one. Um, I know that there is a beautiful, uh, is it Gorkum? Gorkum has a, a cover through Rabbit Comics that is a beautiful cover. Uh, but I did not read this. I heard the story was okay. But uh, yeah, Capisi, the Dragon Incident, right? Yeah, the Dragon Incident. Number one. So I'll have to, I'll have to check it out now. All right, here we go. Next book up. Maiden Korea, okay. This is what, number number three? All right, so there we go, number three of Maiden Korea. And then, now I think we're gonna get into, what well, we are, because I just saw the one, the three, the three exclusives. So here we go, first up. Here's that Johnny B. Sardinia's palette knife technique. You got little Hotato. If you have not read We Live, get the trade, check it out, because We Live, Age of Paladon, Paladins, or Paladins is coming out in March. Your boy cannot wait. I cannot wait to see Potato in action. Man, I'm excited, excited, excited to see where we go next. After the after that first volume of We Live, I, I, it was incredible. Next up, we got another Primordial. So here we go. We got another Nino Primordial, number one. We'll take it. That's fine. And then the last but not least is the Nina Haas uh, Nightmare Blog. This is the Ivan Tao Virgin variant. This is not the, yeah, this is not the uh, sketch variant, but this is 202 of 400, 202 of 400. So, hey, not a bad book. I'll take it. And yeah, so that's what we got there. Uh, you guys let me know in the comments below which one did you guys like more did you like the uh the 50 dollars mystery box which gave you 10 books seven back issues three exclusive or exclusives or did you like the exclusive mystery box which gave you five exclusives from rabbit comics i am a big fan of rabbit comics you know so i i'm definitely going to support them i'm, I'm rooting for them because i want to see them do very well you can you can communicate easily with them they are very reachable and they're in my backyard. They're in my backyard. They're from they're from the neighborhood. So uh, I'm happy with that. I, I'm happy to support a local business as well. That's just a bonus for me. Um, but yeah, they got some beautiful covers. Shared with other people, it don't matter. They have some beautiful covers. I love them. Uh, again, I found them through Something's Killing Children number 16. Uh, when the Valentin Pesh, uh, they dropped the three books for that. Got all three of them. Love them all. I uh, have two right now at CGC getting graded, just waiting for them to come back uh, like so many other people. But yeah, that's what we have there. Let me know in the comments below. Did you guys like these mystery boxes? Do you think they were worth it? Uh, let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. And again, we are always striving for 10. Yes, 10. Oh, that's a lot. 10 whole likes. Let's see if we can get there this week. As always, tell somebody you love them. Thank you guys so much for watching this schmuck open a mystery box. Uh, I tell you guys that all the time. Over 800 of you folks are subscribed to me. Uh, and you guys watch me open stuff. We are changing up the content here on the channel. We're doing some different stuff on Wednesdays and Fridays. We got our Sunday live stream. We're also gonna be doing a different style live stream on Thursday. So definitely make sure you hit that notification button. We're doing kind of like a Thursday thought town hall thing. You want to talk about what's the difference between cameos and first appearances come hang out on, on thursday 8 30 p.m eastern again thank you guys so much i love you all tell somebody you love them i'm average will and always <laughs> out